as hope begins to glimmer, and we begin to see the end of our time in exile at home, there are still moments of rest and relaxation. This is Lockdown Bar. Uh, this week's poem is entitled The Empty School. I am alone among men. Tonight I am joyless. Left desolate after the others, finding no food of gladness. I do not understand these speakers who speak our mother tongue. I can find none that I know, for I see no one like myself. Every full encampment is to me the same as a desert after my comrades. Yet it would be crowded to me if there were but one poet within. The three forges wherein I was wont to find mental delight. That I cannot visit these forges wears away the armory of my mind. The house of memorizing of our gentle lad. It was a trysting place of youthful companies. Embers red and shining, that was our forge at the first. The house of reclining, for such as we, the university of art, poetic cell that kept us from beguilement. This was the great forge of our trained on riff. The house of the critic, of each fine work of art was the third house of our three forges, which multiplied the clinging tendrils of knowledge, wherein the very forge of science was wont to be. Three sanctuaries wherein we took rank, three forges that sustained the loving companies of artists, houses that bound comrades together. A blessing on them for their nobility, men to whom hard poems were no perplexity, that gathering worthy of love, dark verse was to them no darkness. In their midst a spring day or a winter's night was brief. Lacking them, those who have escaped, make a month now of a single day. Hard is their toil, when men of learning find not the bright-threaded artistry of illustrious scholars to whom belonged the mystic import of words. Woe to the quarter, whence came their slackness in meeting together. The cause of the dispersion of the school is that the gales of Macha are in bond. You may notice a theme in some of these poems surrounding the decline of bardic poetry as a result of colonialism and colonisation. And this feeds into that. The bard here, the poet, is lamenting the fall of a school, the school where he was educated and possibly would have taught in. The final line... The school is, the cause of the dispersion of the school is that the gales of Macha are in bondage. This likely refers to how many of the bardic schools were being shut down, being gotten rid of, uh, outlawed under colonial rule. I hope you have enjoyed this poem. I thank you for listening.